Now, the big announcement. Um, announcing with NVIVO 15, your research team just grew by one with in, in vivo with AI assistant. So drum roll, um, I'll give people to have that sink in a little that um, now you have uh, an AI assistant within in vivo. <laughs> so <clears throat> uh, I wanted to, Oop, I like the emoji, so. <laughs> um, I wanted to talk about our approach to using um, AI. So our product team did a lot of research. We talked to a lot of customers, we did surveys, we had advisory board, because um, we wanted to make sure we got this right. Uh, so our approach is first, we always want the researcher to be at the helm. And so it's your data, it's your project, so you have control of what you're using with the AI assistant. We also wanted to make sure it was very transparent and observable. So you always see when the AI um, is working with your data. Um, so you, you, always, you always see that you can decide if you wanna use it or not use it. And of course, we always uh, have data security. So that's always a very important um, aspect of any of, the so uh, any of the softwares group create is data security. So I sort of want to delve into these features a little bit more. Um, so one of the big things is you can dive into reflective thinking. So with the AI assistant, you're really going to be able to use the memos more. So it's going to be more um, in the forefront of your analysis. So uh, you can um, summarize parts of text, summarize um, whole documents. Um, so it really helps you sort of jumpstart those creative um, juices and analysis and thinking about your data. Um, it also fines tune your coding. So as a researcher, you're going to be in charge of your broad coding categories, uh, but then you can use that AI assistant to help you um, go into the deeper levels of coding. So more of the refined coding and, and sub coding. But again, you can decide if you keep those codes or don't want them in your project based on what the AI does. Um, it's also going to help you unpack jargon or technical language. So, you know, I know when I'm reading a lit review article, uh, there's some um, technical uh, language that I, I'm not sure of. I can e easily get a definition now with the in vivo AI assistant. It'll help me also with um, local uh, idioms or um, jargon. So if I'm interviewing somebody and they're they're saying a local term, I can look that up and it'll also help me translate from one language to another. Uh, so you don't have to be fearful that you're not in control. You're always in control with what you bring in with AI and what um, you don't want to bring into your project. You can accept or reject it. And then uh, your data is open. Oh. Uh, your data is always secure. So um, the AI, after the AI completes its task, the information is then sent to NVivo and then deleted from the server. So it does not stay in the server. 您的直觉，我们的软体，买正版软体找齐全企业有限公司，同一编号二八七九三九六七，所有产品皆享咨询。Cheer Chain Enterprise distributes and sells software with the aim of offering clients guidance. When choosing software, as well as technical support, 